some point, you feel like I just can't take this anymore. But instead of falling back, you continue pushing on into the unknown. Somewhere down the line, everything may well go to pieces. This is it. You'll think to yourself, this is where I meet my downfall. Now that's up to you. You either accept it or you get on with the job. We just begin. We fix things step by step. You solve one problem and then you move on to the next. I want to remind everyone here of the immense power that lies in the mind. You can think your way into a state of stress, of misery, of frustration. Conversely, by setting your mind right, you can change your life completely. You have to decide what you want it to be. Way ahead is tough. It's hard to keep a good attitude. So as you work toward your goals, make sure your mind is focused upon the future. When you find yourself thinking negatively, I can't really do this. Take note and say to yourself, no, I have to be able to make a way. We control our minds, not the other way around. Our minds should be molded to believe that we are capable. Even though it is tough, we can handle it. Nothing worthwhile in life comes easily. Everything truly valuable in life demands hard work. But you can't always just do what feels good. The way forward may involve some tedium and difficulty, but it's up to us to persevere until we become our best selves. Playing small does not offer satisfaction. Playing small does not offer satisfaction. You don't realize your potential. What if you put in everything you got, only to fall short? What if you get tired? Start to doubt yourself. Many do. They get disappointed. Return to their former ways to think. It's no good. It's hopeless. But you are the boss. You're the captain, the helmsman, and the thinker of your life. Don't give that up to anybody else. You can always improve. You can surpass anything you have ever done, break pattern upon mold, crest new peaks. There is no easy path to success. If life knocks you down, get up again. While it may not be your fault when things go wrong, it's your responsibility to get back on your feet. But you are your own master. You are the commander, the general of your life. Don't let anybody else have control over it. The path of true freedom is hard, responsible, and full of difficulties. Walk that road, keep pushing, keep working, and the rest will take care of itself. Think, think on all the hard days you've been through. You've made it through every one of them. Your hit ratio for overcoming tough times is 100. Success is a lonely road. It is painful and full of sacrifices. You may get there alone, because it's a long, hard road. We make even the smallest things count. You have to get out there and live like this, where every touch is for rain. There will be times when you are alone, weak, and feeling self-doubt. Others may also doubt you. You may even start to think that you are crazy. But even at the darkest moment, don't let the darkness consume you. Your inner light, your will, and your determination, these are your strength. No matter how fierce a struggle, as long as you stand up, it can only be success. One gets defeated only when one surrenders, only when one gives up. Is that the end? He believe in yourself. It will be all right. I'm asking you to count on your imagination. And when you grow, when you succeed, use your imagination. Keep dreaming, keep following your dreams, keep seeking them. That is the truest kind of success. Although some people might call you unrealistic, that doesn't matter. No matter what type of storm you are facing today, don't give up. It hurts and may seem like your dream is out of reach, but don't quit now. The best days of your life are still ahead. When it no longer makes sense to continue using logic, use your emotions, your anger, frustration to keep going. Many small battles are fought before the war can be won. Get up in the morning, work out, study, and do the things you don't like. That is how you win the daily fight. You would not always want to do what is necessary, but you have to do it. Stop telling yourself that you are doing enough. You can always do more. Outwork everyone before you can be satisfied with life. You're going to hit walls. Everybody does. These walls, however, can be shocking and painful enough that only a few people will step forward. No pain, no gain, as they say. The process, led and worn, makes you it's not just the end result. Struggle, the hunt, the practice, the fight. It's these things that become who you are. Ought to want your success more than you do. With no other choice but to be successful, chances for success are high. 
you will succeed no matter what. So how much longer are you going to wait? Another minute, another hour, another day or week? Don't wait. Certainly don't accept someone else telling you that you are unworthy. If you truly desire something, you will find a way to achieve it. It's about making a commitment to yourself, nobody else.